so hello people of the interwebs how are you um apologies for the rather long delay um, i have tried to put stuff together um three times and the day just turned into a massive disaster so i just kind of said just said give up basically um so yeah, apologies for that but anyway um we'll try and put this together Wow, um, six weeks, seven weeks is the last one. Lots of people are complaining. I'm a busy man, you know, busy man. So, what has happened? Well, um, not a lot really. Very busy. Um, been very busy to the point not had much time to press record. So, yeah, sorry about that. And I'm not going to lie. I have thrown my teddies out the pram a little bit there. A little bit. So is somebody else I know, so you know, uh, you know who you are. Um, apologies for the end joke on that one. So yeah, um, what else is it, what else is it? Unfortunately, the Queen passed away, very sad. And I'm technically um, halfway dead, because I've turned 40 as well. I now have to get up three times a night to take a pee. Wonderful. Yeah, so I do hope everyone's good. Hello the old, hello the new, hello the ones in the middle. Uh, we tipped those three machines off this morning. They were up in, um, up on the Breckham Road. Then the road going into that job, there's a crane gone up the road and it's having a bit of a lie down on the banking. So nobody can get in and out the job. Um, shouldn't laugh, but you know, hey, it's one of them things. Um, I don't like going up there and there's a crane gone up here and he's just gone off to the side unfortunately um, it happens so he was having a very good Monday and my Monday now actually seems pretty much better than his Monday was so yeah you know and we're now just loaded two machines off Flannery's yay one's going to Ponty One's going to Pentra, and then we got one to collect um, up in the hills, shall we say. So I'll be all right. Nice little jolly today. It's a um, short week for me as well, because I'm having a couple of days off. Why am I having a couple of days off? Because these are the first days off I've had this year, so yeah, I think I've earned them. And you know, sometimes your work gets to you. I should ignore a lot of things that go on, but I can't. Anyway, so we're leaving Newport. We're going to giddy on up and get um, these two machines off. It's only a nine ton machine and a, and a roller. Yeah, we'll see how the day goes now. Shouldn't be too bad of a day. Shouldn't be too bad of a day. Yeah. First delivery substation. Yay. Mm. Oh well. I would give you the company name, but it's just no point. The bigger the companies, the, the worse they are. And that's no joke either. Um, <laughs> the other week I suppose I delivered, uh, picked the machine up out of um, Hinkley Point, out of the new, uh, the new power station, nuclear power station. So I'm about halfway there, phones the customer, um, only for them to tell me I can't collect the machine. The keys for the compound are not on site. And they need 72 hours notice before they can, <laughs> before we can collect anything. Wow, 74 hours, uh, 72 hours notice. Right, he's waving me down, but yet I got bollards in front of me. I know what'll happen if I move him. Oh, let's go and find out. Schoolboy error, us. Schoolboy error. Um, so the marshal brought me into this lovely little piece by her now. I want to turn around with there. I can't because behind that machine there is all contaminated ground. So I can't turn there now. And behind me, I don't know if you can see it, there's a, there's a really sexy 90 degree blind cider. Oh, it's got me all fuzzy and warm inside. 
all the health and safety for this company and yet they haven't got an ounce of common sense security the guardian saying oh can't go down there no 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 instead just go on down but just follow me down school by air i shouldn't have come down here oh well so you're gonna wait for two little machines to be moved and then we're gonna reverse out there I'm sat here uh, 10 minutes now waiting for machines to be moved and now they've just moved on. See how much of a mess I'm going to make of this now. Uh, tag up, nope. Too heavy. Never mind, we'll override that one. I had to get him to move the two machines. So I'm going to put the front of the cab over as far as I can and I... Why risk it? Might be too bad now, this might not. The attitude of turning round down here wasn't that very good either. It's good for health and safety, isn't it? Be nice if they just told me not to come down and just tipped it up where I got it because now I got to reverse out on the main road as well. A very busy main road. Which I don't know. Not the best. No, it's not too bad. I got a guy waving at me back. Keep coming, keep coming. I can't. I'm gonna get to this bit first. Two machines parked bang on where those um, skips were. Yeah, yeah. No, no cares though. No, I can't turn it, mate. Tough. You have to practice your skills. Well done. Well done. I love that attitude. Practice your skills. Stuff the health and safety. Just practice your skills, mate. Ba 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 This. No, I will. You watch. Do you know what? I think we've had probably the warmest September like Max can remember. It's been absolutely boiling. Oh, that wasn't as bad as I thought. That was quite uh, tame, to be honest with you. I'm absolutely starving. Do you know what? I might have to go and reward myself with a ham and cheese roll. I haven't brought nothing with me this week because I'm not doing a full week. <laughs> I could have probably struggled to turn around down here, but no, we'll have you reverse out onto the main road instead. Well, thank you very much, you absolute plant pot. Banksman, hot tip for you. 
never walk directly behind the vehicle so I can't see it, always walk to the side. Do you know what, I mean, before I even come down here, I should have known not to. My um, driver's instincts just weren't working very well that moment. My stand for my camera is rattling. Whoop. Can we do it in one? You know, we're nearly there now. We're nearly there. If I remember this road goes around to my left, so yeah. Yeah, so we have to get him now to go stand in the busy traffic. Right, get off yeah. This. Come to a job. I picked the machine up from before. So they're working on a bridge down there. This is the footpath. When I um when I first come here last time, I picked up a 14 ton machine. But turned up the site, couldn't find anyone. Uh, nobody knew anything about this. It was a school, well, the caretaker for the school up there. He said, oh, I might be down here now, no problem. So I walk down here, then I had to walk all the way back, get the lorry, and reverse all the way down here. Because the machine was on steel tracks. There's a tree just by ya, which is a bit naughty on the cab. Is it too? Ah, just playing out in front. Yes, yeah, it was lots of fun. Friday afternoon. Uh, people everywhere. There's a uh, there's a learning school in here um, with disabled adults. Uh, yeah, yeah, disabled adults. Um, and some of them were getting a bit nervy when they were walking down past me, so I'm to stop to stop doing what I was um, doing. Obviously, they didn't walk past. Great place, though, isn't it? Lovely. When I was on my way here, I thought I recognised the address. I'm positive I know that address, and I did. And when I come out here, yeah, I couldn't turn right by you because uh, it was too tight. Uh, the trailer was trying to drag round into the posts on the side. So I'm hoping, because I'm empty, she will go round the corner now. Nice and easily, I'm hoping. Because obviously when the trailer's heavy, she'll try to cut across more. I am open. We can just turn out because I had to reverse out here last time. I had to go around to the left and then reverse back up and out. Which is not what you want to be doing. <sighs> all fun, people. This is all fun. All sent to try you. noises I don't want to hear. Right now, let's see if she will go around this corner. It's going to be tight this is now. Just, just watch the back end of the trailer. She don't catch the, the railings on that side. Hopefully, hopefully. I think Oh that's tight people, that is tight I 
or like a glove? Like a glove. Now, up over the fall. We're going to pick up a 10 ton track dumper, um, which I think is out in the middle of nowhere, sort of. Do you know what? If it wasn't for the fact I have a beautiful girlfriend sat in the house, I'd be over there now giving him my best lines. I would, honestly. <laughs> Speed dating in Wales. Can't beat it, can I? It doesn't do it justice looking across here over this camera. I've had a break in worse places, I suppose. And that over there is, um, well, Trioki, basically. All right, my lover. How are you? Hey, 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 me, you. <laughs> Ah, oh, look at it. Beautiful. All right, um, our dumper's just up in by there. <sighs> Backed in, ready to go. We're going to get it, get it on and get out of here. Right, and we are off. Track dumper. All on the pedals. One times arm so that you can tip up and down. If you want to slow the body round. These things will go anywhere though. The, the last one of these I drove had a, a watch him call it. So um, yeah, so the idea of these, which are really cool, is you can actually turn the lever, slow the body around. So if you're working in tight spaces, spin it around. I'm back out the same way. How cool is that? I reckon it's cool anyway. It's quite a big body on these. It's all done. Off that, up, down, left and right. I was watching a video of a guy um, using one of these on a uh, a muck shift job and to be fair he was absolutely flying in it i was i was well impressed to say the least i didn't realize how wide these were 
I'm not gonna lie. Bah, 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 bah. Is that about right? <clears throat> yeah. I like the fact you can turn the cab and uh, actually watch how, uh, how much you are actually over. Didn't realise how wide this was. Right, there she is, nice and easy. Do, do, do. Four chains, two on the front, two on the back. Now away we go. For some reason, I'm not sure if it's, well, I'm not really sure. Um, on some of them, they normally have um, eyelets on the inside. They haven't got them on this for some reason, I don't know why. And the cab's got a, a lock on it so before you knock it off put the cab lock on and it can uh, twist and shout right let's get out there anyway took a bit longer than i planned i did again because it's a new day oh um we got um fingers crossed fingers crossed should have a little simple day today should i hope so but you know that can all change <clears throat> gotta pick a container up here because we're about to meet the dry uh the grainy uppy downy guy we're gonna meet him he's gonna put a container on us because the job is finished and it's got to go to another job, which is starting to, in fact, today. Um, so they got facilities. So that's our first job of the day. Let's see how this goes, shall we? Should be all right. Have faith. sound but this was a um, school we demolished a couple of years back done a couple of videos of it as well so now we're gonna build a new one nice and easy I was straight off right we'll go pick some big blocks up now so plan is this pop the blocks on here all the way down the bed so when I get back to the yard um, I can just offload them with a forklift because I know there's, um, well, I know the boys are busy. Otherwise, it takes two of you to take them off because you need somebody to hook them. And obviously, you drive a machine, otherwise, you're just up and down, up and down like a yo yo, which is not what I want. Got to lift the aid to go in here because I catch a trailer on the back of the ramp. 
as I found out. It's an absolutely beautiful day. I was down there the other day and it absolutely lamped it down like you wouldn't believe. Never had a problem finding timbers around a dock or dunnage, whatever you want to call them. And that's all I could find. That is it. There's not a stick or twig out there lying around. Mad. Absolutely mad. I've never seen it. It's, just, it's a stupid little thing, but like I said, every time I've gone to a dock, no matter what it is, Felix or Liverpool, Southampton, there's tons of wood around them, timbers and tonnage to, <laughs> for, for, to help you get loaded. Like, All right, let's get these on anyway. All right, that's what we got then. Nice little load of blocks. Strap over each. Nice and easy. All right, let's get these tipped off now. He's dying. Yeah, we'll forget about him. Oh, do you know how much he's worth? Go on. They're 400 quid. What are they? They're fucking gaskets. Ooh. 400 pound. 400 pound gasket? That's not good, is it? Okay. And this is why we're here today. We got a leak. What, have you washed it? Uh, no. Uh, not yet. No, because I... I just wanted to show people the uh, devastation of my little girl. It's not good, is it? So he's going to fix that. For me, he don't know it yet. And we've got an hydraulic leak as well. Um, so... Oh, it's making a funny noise. Um, yeah, so I need to change some pipes on here as well because they're rubbing. And we've got to fix you some um, shiny bits on you. Do, 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 do. So we're going to strip that off, take these off, get it steamed off, get it back in ya, and then, um, well, get it sorted basically. She hasn't been very well lately, she broke down twice. Um, you know, she's she's not old. What would you class my truck as a, as a category of woman? A MILF? What do you reckon, right? If my truck was a category of woman, what would you call it? A MILF? Cool guy, it's not that old. Oh, be a cool guy. It's only fucking She's getting on a little bit, like you know. Yeah, we're gonna go for the MILF. So she needs some TLC. Cool Ugh, bam, we got one bolt. Okay, one bolt, can't get out. Typical in there. Fair place to scan you, they don't have to shove the stuff in there. Wow. <laughs> Even got hay still in you from his previous owner. Oh, oh well. Never yeah, mind. All good fun. All good fun. <laughs> look, at that, look, at, look at the cleanest overalls in the world. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, one bolt, which can't get that one out. It's just got a flat end under there. If in doubt, get out the big ugga chugga chug. Fuck it, the egg and chugger's not doing it. Get the, get the egg and chugger on it. Get a big bar. Anyway. That's not good, is it? 
Ah, right, so <laughs> that's not going down very well, struggling to get that off. So we got four little lights to go on here. Yeah? We're gonna have one about by there, two, three, and one the end, four. The problem is, I thought it'd be nice and easy to do, and it's turning out not to be very easy. <sighs> so here we go. This could all go drastically wrong. I'm not saying Russ has completely balls this up, but it's not going very well. <laughs> I'm an alligator. <laughs> two hours? Yeah, two hours to do one, two, three, four. And I got four more to do. I'm not a happy man. Some days I shouldn't be allowed to come up with bright ideas. I should just, like, not be allowed. Um, <sighs> the man is here. He's doing our pipe. Um, there's a tool over there. He just got to fix a new one. So, <sighs> that's what the crank looks like. And then we got, oh, I'm sorry. And then we got, Ah, the casings. Uh, bottom. That's plastic, we said, don't know. Yeah. No, I thought they were cast. It's not, but that one is. That's it. So that's the bottom, bottom. That's the next bit. What's the technical word for it? First stage and second stage. Yeah, first stage, second stage. No, first stage, second stage. First stage, second stage. Shouldn't be allowed out on my own, should I? All right, and um, do these next ones. Not looking forward to it. <sighs> Got a state of that. They only took me like, I don't know, 20 minutes. That one took me two hours, but I found a nice easy way of doing it, which worked. It wasn't the most professional way. Um, my truck is absolutely falling apart. And um, now we've got a water leak. Where's the water leak? Where's the water leak? Right here. Show the people the water leak. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Yeah, yeah. that's the water leak. My MILF is turning into a cougar because it's just <laughs> kicking up more and more problems. This is not funny today. It's not brutal as fuck. So, that pipe's not good. That was the pipe that broke um, two months ago. Three-ish, let's see. So, no. Um, yeah. This is still pissing water out, right? It's not peeing water out, it's leaking. Not leaking, sorry. This is a family channel, right? <laughs> PG team. Are you double short of this going your bad? It's not good, right? people. Not good. I know somebody will be watching this now and absolutely laughing their back doors off. We can fix it. We can get it going. She'll be, she'll be like good as new now tomorrow or tonight. If Bob can do it. Ethan, can we fix it? It's not looking good, people. Chai Chester Craig. It's not. Jay Chester from Scania Keltrek, we love you. Oh, nice one. What was his name? Craig Jay Chester. Craig, Craig from Scania Keltrek, Cardiff. Yeah, Cardiff? Newport? Yeah, Cardiff. Yeah, well Banning. done. Exact pipes that we needed. Right. Um, we'll have to find out. Come back next week to see if she's working or not. Because it's not looking good. She's fucking no She could be going to the big compound in the sky. 
Fuck off. Language. Fuck off. I wouldn't let that happen. Sorry about that. Anyway, um, today has not panned out. Will she rise like a phoenix? I hope so. <laughs>